now I would be telling you how I have connected my camera and the VTX to this uh, N2 OSD. So as you can see, uh, this N2 OSD, sorry. So as you can see, uh, this N2 OSD is actually energized from the PMU at this end. So the supply to the N2 OSD is coming from here, from the PMU and it's going to the OSD. And now since uh, you want to energize the camera and the VTX, so I have taken the supply from this uh, battery voltage, the plus and the negative and uh, this uh, this supply is coming here through this connection and now it is coming going to the N2 OSD so with this the camera and the VTX will also get powered so the connection to the camera as you can see I'm using the Foxy camera so this is the connection to the camera and the VTX so I'll be using this uh, TBS uh, Unify H3 so this is the connector for that and then directly it will be energized with the help of the battery voltage so it is a simple connection as uh, you can see once again I will explain this is the N2 OSD this I am using as a substitute of IOSD and I found it very good so this is the switch this is the button from where you can actually change the mo various modes of the OSD and uh, the input supply to the OSD is coming from the NASA PMU there's a uh, control uh, cables for this uh, gimbal control this cable uh, the orange cable or the brown cable will be used for uh, RSSI signal and this yellow cable which is actually going uh, yeah this is again an important point this yellow cable is going to my receiver uh, which I have connected to the X2 port of uh, NASA V2 so I have uh, inserted this pin of this connector into the signal wire you know if you can see this is a SBUS connection which I will be using so you know if you can see this is the this is the S bus connection this connection is coming from NASA V2 X2 port okay so this will be going to my uh, XATR uh, receiver this is my receiver so it will be going to XATR receiver and uh, this yellow wire which is coming from the IOSD it may be yellow or it may be white also don't get confused just see the manual so this wire will go into the signal wire of the connector and then it will give the feed like the mode selection as well as the throttle percentage to the OSD I hope it is clear so this is the on the input side and then the output side uh, we are getting the <coughs> camera input from this this camera input is actually this this input and which is coming from the camera and the other the output video out will be going to the TBS Unify Pro VTX so this complete simple setup is actually used for setting up the NASA N2 OSD so I actually found it uh, on YouTube so I googled it so many places but I could not find any proper explanation so I am making this uh, small video for you guys uh, let me know below in comments in case you have any doubts I try to clarify that thank you and keep watching TJ's channel Joe FPV thank you